What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Sword, and we were just betrayed by Sonya's assistant, whose name I cannot even re freaking remember. Wait, don't just leave without saying anything, but you were upset, we didn't want to say anything to make it worse. We were trying to be considerate, but of course I'd be down on myself, it was my fault, I got tricked by a naked in the Wooloo's clothing. But that's it, no more feeling sorry for myself. That lot made off with bandits, made off like bandits with all the wishing stars. It'd be awful if they were used for some evil purpose, so there's no time to be feeling down. Oh, <laughs> you've got some guts. You've certainly grown strong in the face of adversity, dearie. Graham, Dynamaxing draws out the true strength from the trust between a Pokemon and their trainer, but that group is likely pouring the Gala Particles emitted by the Wishing Star into Pokemon forcing them to Dynamax. That's awful. Indeed, what an awful thing to do to Pokemon. The theft of the Wishing Stars was just the start. Things could get a lot worse from here on out. But why? What reason could they have for forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? Those weirdos said that they wanted to reveal the true natures of Zacian and Zamazenta? I'm curious about what my former assistant said about a royal lineage. Did she mean it literally? Ah, Blaze, look at your town map. I'm detecting huge reactions at four stadiums now. They certainly get around, don't they? If there's trouble at the stadiums, then Marnie could be in a real bad way. Ah, uh, Spike must seems to be okay. There's no power spot stadium there. <laughs> Righto. <laughs> Blaze, this is no time to be lying about. If Pokemon are in trouble, why are we still here? Let's get right out there to lend a hand. I'm sorry to leave it all to you, but you'll have to take care of the Dynamax Pokemon. I'll search for those sword and weird shield weirdos in the meantime. Uh, appreciate it. my Pokemon healed up though okay yeah let's see where where we're gonna go first she said four locations so we could go do dragon I uh, think that was rock or fighting uh, we'll just go all the way over here to uh, Bologna Bologna <laughs> and we're gonna put Toxtricity out front. See our boy Bead. Hmm, you lot. Bead, what about the Dynamax Pokemon? You think I, the elite fairy type gym leader, would have any kind of trouble? That's right, you're a gym leader now, though I don't know about elite or whatever. Please, please don't tell me you came here to help. First of all, and second, I didn't, didn't need any help. Why'd I know you say something like that? We came all the way out here just to lend a hand. What an obnoxious gym leader. The next gym challenge is shaping up to be really something. Alina tricked and used me. From now on, only I decide how I live. And I think what I should do now is have a battle with you, Blades. Look, I'm sorry, mate, but this is hardly the time. Don't always be in such a hurry, boy. You aced my quiz, so show a little composure. Beat has already quieted three Dynamax Pokemon. He's given you the luxury of some extra time. Beat's life won't be bound by what other people say any longer, although I certainly influenced a few of his decisions not too long ago. Now that you mention it, I suppose you did. Yeah, yeah, as expected of a wise 88-year-old granny, I guess. But that has nothing to do with Miss Opal. This battle's for me. Now, don't dilly-dally. Your only option to us accept. My Pokemon and I have risen from the ashes. I'll grant you a brief glimpse at how amazing we've become. Of course, Bead chooses like the wrong time to challenge me. Like, bro, I got stuff to do. I wasn't expecting to really start off battling him. <laughs> My days as a gym leader have made me stronger than you. It made you stronger than... Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> it made you stronger than the champion. I think Endgame is now when the game really shines. It looks like the Pokemon are all like around our level now. Or maybe I'm just trash for not going in and overleveling my team. Uh, I think we can outspeed God of War. Oh yeah, I totally forgot to intimidate. <laughs> oh, 
I might just switch into um, into Grim Smile just because Future Sight won't affect him when he's out there. Darkest Lariat. Just because I like the I like the animation for it on Grim Snarl. No, I never liked Dragon Rush just because its accuracy to me is trash. Storm Snarl went and did his thing. I'm proud of him. You just might be the strongest champion in Galarian history. I've still got a ways to go. I'll make sure to draw out every last bit of strength from you and then triumph. So the Pokédex entry for this Pokémon is that if it, it can sense up like to 30 miles away like a person being like extremely like angry or something and it'll chase them down and like beat the crap out of them. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. This is why I need Sludge Bomb on this guy. My special attack is way better than my uh, physical attack. Expecting that. Well, good thing I'm a physical attacker. Ah, oh, you want to know? Hammer arm. Uh, I guess we can get rid of. Dark Pulse. So now I have another Pokemon that knows like a fighting move. So now I could technically have him go up against um, Dark types and Rock types or something. This must be some mistake. I mean, I'm the one who's the gym leader. Thank you for the battle. I can now accept you as the champion. It's painful to admit, but I've come to realize a few of my weaknesses. But I'll keep getting stronger. I'll reach the pinnacle of what fairy types can do. Now then, as the gym leader, I will do my duty and clean the stadium. Now that's what I would call a perfectly pink Pokemon battle. Even after losing his right to participate in the gym challenge, Beat still found his own way to crash the champion cup. Yeah, I'd say he's a force to be reckoned with. I think I get why he was chosen to be the next gym leader. He might be un unbearable at times, or really most of all the time, if you're a strainer. Yeah, he's really strong. He's strong enough that even a champion like you recognizes it, huh? If you both are going to keep talking, how about I fetch you a nice cuppa? A nice cuppa? <laughs> Right, right, I hear you, and I won't be outdone by Beat or anyone. On to the next one. So 
So the reason those red and blue buffoons could make so many people with Dynamax was because they hoarded up so many wishing stars. Things will probably get even tougher from here. We still got three more stadium where there's some Dynamax Pokemon running wild. Let's up the tempo. I mean, I wanted to, but they insisted I battle. Y'all make it seem like it's my fault I had to do that battle. I couldn't even reject doing it, actually. They was like, yo, this is what we gonna have you do, bro. This literally just makes me try to remember uh, what each area was so I know like what type to to put out there to come combat Bayo you all did you come to lend us a hand eh, something like that how are things looking we just finished getting everyone to safety, so I was about to challenge the Dynamax Pokemon. Nice one. Then let's all work together. I give you my most heartfelt thanks. We've got several opponents, so we may as well take one each. I'll be counting on you all. Here we go. Wait, we have multiple Dynamax Pokemon to fight? Is it in one battle? We just gotta, we have to fight it like ourselves, each one. Okay. Up, you know what that means. Let's do this thing, buddy. I really wish I had that custom form for Grimmsnarl though, I don't know how to get it. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Alright, we did our thing with that. I guess that kind of makes up for time. I can't thank you all enough. With your help, the Dynamax Pokemon have all been returned to normal. I'll keep them safe here in the stadium, so no need to worry. Blades. Next time I'll be the one who saves you in your hour of need. Give me a call if you're ever in a rough spot. I still don't get how we're supposed to call you with these. If there are other places that need champions help, please go look after them. I'll protect the peace of Stone on Side Stadium with all my might. Blades, we've got to help all the other places where these Dynamax Pokemon are running wild. Looks like there's two Pokemon Stadiums left to check. Alrighty. We're gonna do Dragon Last. And of course, I always got to heal up my team. I'm actually take, surprised it's taking forever for a uh, surprise trade to, to find someone to trade with right now. Maybe it's because I keep going like in and out of battles or something. I don't know. This is rock, so I think I want to have Rillaboom out there. Uh, 
I don't know, surprisingly, like, I like the design of Rillaboom. Get to safety, you three. Who do you think you're talking to, then? We're here to help, not be helped. Oh, actually, I didn't realize who I was talking to. Blade's here, so everyone can relax. I was just thinking over how to handle all the Dynamax Pokemon. With all of you here, we can take each one of them on. Let's hurry to the pitch. I'm kind of glad I started off with battling Bead now. I feel like that was like the highlight of the episode so far. Just because these other battles are going by pretty fast. I need to start doing more raid battles. I don't know if like when I'm on Twitch streaming if I'll just stream raid battles or something, but I don't know, I think it'd be pretty fun to do that. I just wanted to see why we get healed up, but it doesn't explain it. Everyone, no one's hurt, are they? Huh, just barely. Battling a Dynamax Pokemon all on your own is pretty hard work. I expected nothing less from you, Blades. You seem like quite the reliable trainer, too. Hop. I, I do? Looks like he ain't used to compliments. Looks like he got a grin wider than a meow. I do not. Shut your god, Piers. I'll take care of the Pokemon we battled, so there's no need for any of you to worry, alright? Blades, it's hardly a reward for what you've done for me, but please take a copy of my Elite card. If anything comes up, please contact me. Alright, then I wish you all the best of luck for the future. Alright, later, Gordy. Looks like most of the stadiums have got this Dynamax problem sorted out. Let's keep up the pace, Blades. There's only one Pokemon Stadium with Dynamax trouble left. Let's finish this already. Yep, while you guys do that, I think I'm gonna buy like the rest of these outfits. I keep coming in here and thinking like, hey, I need to buy these outfits, and I never do. This is how I get like the cooler shoes that I actually want that'll match better, I guess. I don't know, I have money to spare. Alrighty. Now we can head to, I think it was Hammerlock now? I think Hammerlock's the only place left. And since that's Dragon, um, I need to get Ice Beam for my Lodic. Icy Wind's not really cutting it for me as far as like a good like Ice move to have. So that means I'm gonna be starting off with a uh, Grim Snarl out there. Oops, I don't know why I went to items. Huh? 
Nice timing, you lot. The stadium's just about reached its limit. There's simply too many Dynamax Pokemon running wild in here. Seems Wishing Star Power is being used for some evil purpose. So that's what's caused all this? That's a problem, all right. Before we get that sorted, we got to do something about these Dynamax Pokemon. Glad we've got you all here now, though we've already done the bulk of the work. We're here to help too, right, Blades? Yep, we'll take care of this. Fantastic, looks like we got ourselves together an unbeatable team. Especially you, Piers. The way you battled me in the Champion Cup, you really have my Dynamax Pokemon against the wall. Things might actually go better this time if we split up our little band. <laughs> right, everyone, split up so we can each take down one of the Dynamax Pokemon. Let's do it. Good thing I already have an Axorus too. <laughs> but I think Haxorus might know Steel type move. It could be Steel or Poison. I think he learned Iron Tail or Poison Jab. I'll be real with you guys though, I do plan on making a dragon team on here. I'll probably be that competitive dragon uh, type. Yep, steel move. <laughs> oh, that was a crit. That's why it did so much. That makes, that makes sense. I feel like I should... I feel like I should use like a full restore now, since that was a crit. Maybe I'll be able to get one more hit in before he takes him out. Maybe this is going to take him out and I just like prolong the match. <laughs> oh, okay, great. We survived. <laughs> Sweet. And it was a crit. Nice. We need that. Why can't we get that in the beginning? Could have saved us so much time. You guys are the greatest. You really got me out of a tough spot there. I think I'd better snap a quick one to remember this victory by. I'll take care of the Pokemon that went wild. No need for you all to worry about that. Blades, give me a ring if things should go to a pot again. I find it weird that he said he should take like a picture and he just like pressed a button and you know, it was against the floor. I'm always happy to lend a hand if I can. The great Raihan is here for you anytime. And Piers, you and I have got a battle again. This time, no Dynamaxing for either of us. Wishing Star is being used for evil. I assume you're already looking into who's behind it, right? Carry on then. I'll take care of things here at the Hammerlock Stadium. All right, that was the last one that we needed to take out. So now we're about to progress the story a little bit more, I believe, on where to go now. Right, I think that's all the stadium sorted now. We didn't miss any, did we, Blades? All that's left is to catch those sword and shield weirdos. If we don't find them quick, they could just start all this up again. Wasn't Professor Sonia supposed to be looking into where those two might be? And once we find them again, I'm going to take them right down. That's your rotom phone, Blades. It's gotta be Sonia. Blades, it's me, Sonia. Heck, called it. Those sword and shield weirdos got into Hammerlock Stadium and are headed for the energy plant. The door to the plant's locked, but I think I can get it open. Give me a bit and you'll be able to get in there. Isn't she in here? You hear that, Hammerlock Stadium? Get over there as soon as you can. Even over the phone, Sonya sure sounds lively. We're already at Hammerlock Stadium. The door to the energy plant should be right down the hall. Guess we should get going. Let's, uh, heal my boy up. 
We gotta get rid of these, uh, super potions. But guys, I'm in this episode off right here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel because it helps out the channel a lot. And it keeps you updated on these Pokemon videos and more playthroughs to come. But with that said, stay sharp. Later.